Hey guys, it's me, Alexis Reborns here, coming at you guys with another video. Welcome back to my channel, and hello if you are new. So today, as you can tell by the title of the video, I'm going to be doing a intro video to my new role play series that is coming up next week. But I wanted to give you guys a little intro so you guys know what I'm doing in my next video. I have already started filming. I am currently in the process of editing the first video so you guys will get that either next week or later this week. Um, I kind of want to spread them out a little bit but you guys are going to get this video hopefully today when I'm filming this which is Wednesday which is I'm, I'm already day behind but yesterday I, have a, I had a stomach virus and it was just bad. Today I still have it but I just decided to push through. It came after I came from swimming because I think I drunk water and it just, I, I don't know what really happened with that whole situation but <sighs> I'm here and I'm filming and I'm going to try to upload this today. It is past my upload time also like I literally have like 10 minutes to edit and film this video um, so you guys are probably going to get it out one today I'm not sure but anyways let's hop into this video and um i'm gonna tell you guys basically what the roleplay series is going to be all about and how to not com get confused in this roleplay series because it's really easy to get confused if i'm roleplaying if i'm not roleplaying so the rules of series and how not to get confused so i'm gonna put rp at the end of each video or in the description so it's basically the role play series is going to be consisting of me doing like just a bunch of things tied into one so you guys are gonna get a ton of day in the lives but it's not gonna be like here's a day in the life it's gonna be like vlog style if that makes any sense and I'm going to give the dolls personalities and it's going to be like family vlog channels. If you have ever watched a single mom family vlog channel or if you watch the um, the adoption community, that's just basically what it's going to be. And I'm so excited. Each doll is going to, it's going to be just fun. I don't want to give everything away because I want you guys to like have something to watch. But um, basically... I'm going to give each doll a story behind itself. If you see Cabbage Patch dolls, you know, like they got like a little story. and Or, I mean, American Girl dolls, if you see them, they have like a little story behind them. And Reborns don't really. Some do, but not really. So I want to give my each of my babies a storyline or a life before they came to me. Um, because this is like... Uh, adoption home, uh, foster home, or whatever you want to talk about. And I do have dolls that are in the same age group. For them, dolls that is current, like, in the same age category, age group. Um, I don't know how I'm going to fix that. If you guys have any, like, suggestions down below on how to incorporate every doll in my collection because I feel like it'd be easier if I had like three dolls but I wanted I don't here's here's my picture so you know them like because I have so many like little babies it'd be different if I had like a bunch of toddlers but there's so many little babies like I have the twins I have um what do I have I have the twins I have Noah I have Juliana and you know I have that's a lot I have a lot of little babies so it's kind of harder to incorporate them all in one video so you know some are not gonna be in like the video or they might be like sleeping while they're on the wake or I don't really know how I'm gonna do that uh, like I said I'm still in the mix I'm still planning I'm still editing and filming and all that fun jazz right now where I'm at in the series I'm doing my first episode and we are in the middle of a move so for me to have content for you guys um 
they are at daycare and we're moving and helping them move and it's fun and it's really fun i think you guys are going to really like it you guys are going to like this part and then my next part of the series is going to be me sitting down and talking to you guys and giving each of them a storyline i'm going to do it in the most creative and fun way as i can uh, i have it all planned out i'm still planning this planner does not have like specific dates so i like you can see this this planner doesn't have specific dates it just has like um, Monday through Sunday on it, but it doesn't have like this is 15th, 16th, 15th, 30th. Like, no, it's just plain, and I love that. So, I can plan out whatever date that I want. Um, and I also use my phone and things like that. So, basically, this whole um, series is going to be like a family blog channel. No, my channel is not turning into a vlog channel. I will have one role play video once a week. I'll have a regular, like, non role play video. Maybe I'm talking of a doll chat or um, a change of video or something, a life update or something like that. And then I might have, like, a sit down video. I told you guys I'm going to try to do three videos a week. Last week I exceeded my expectation. That's why I'm giving myself a little bit more of a leeway. I think I posted at least five videos last week. I'm not 100% sure on that but i know i did post a lot of videos last week and i did a lot of editing and i'm patting myself on the back for that because um i'm really in the middle of the move um i have a whole bunch of things i'm currently sick right now which is just irritating and then um i'm also getting ready for school and removing and it's just a lot and i also have youtube and also my dolls that I'm still trying to work on but as of right now I cannot work on them my whole kitchen is packed all my doll stuff is packed my oven is packed so um well not my dog stuff right now my paints and stuff are packed but like my dog kits are still out because I'm looking I'm gonna have to wrap them up just so the ones that I painted don't get scratched up or anything like that which is my customs that I've already painted um, so I'm gonna do a few videos in here that's why i haven't packed in my dolls yet i'm gonna do a few videos in here and then because i wanted to feel like we actually did move because we we actually did move um and i wanted to go accordingly each possibly if you watch the ace family i mean that's like a bad like what's a good family um what is her name i don't know i'll put her picture right here if you watch her channel with her daughter is it her and zaya um she I got inspiration from there um, and they're in the middle of a move and she did like shopping for my new house or shopping for this, shopping for Zaya's room. So I think it's going to be really, really fun and I can't wait and you guys might get confused for the first couple videos and this video might not even help but I wanted to get you like a little tip on what I'm going to be doing in the whole situation. So basically to break it down for you guys, it's going to be like a family vlog channel, like I said. So it's a family vlog channel and I'm going to try to incorporate all the rewards except Sophia because she, I'm, once we move, I'm getting her body. I didn't want to order it now because sometimes it takes a little bit and we're gone when it comes. So um, I'm waiting until we move. Um, so um, she's going to be also be incorporated in this video. She is the oldest sister. She's still the oldest out of all of them she was my second doll anyways but she's also like the one of my biggest dolls her and nick is like the hand in hand like the same size but she's like a little bit bigger um but i think she's like either 30 or 31 inches and nicholas is 29 to 30 inches so um it's a little bit of a height difference here um and then mackenzie of course and then, you know all the rest of them so um it's exciting and i have a lot of six month babies i tend to gravitate towards those six month um and then like i guess you can like to say like nine month babies six to nine month babies and um those are i'm gonna try to incorporate them into the toddler so they, if they're a little bit smaller <laughs> than the actual age that i'm giving them it's okay chill it's all role play it's just so my story progression makes a little bit more sense because i want them to 
be able to play with the toddlers and be able to do this with them and everything like that. Um, they might not be able to do like everything with the toddlers because the toddlers are from age one to two and uh, they're a little bit older. But I've seen one year olds play with like six month year olds who are like capable, well not six months, probably like nine months, um, or, and are capable of still being able to play. Um, some even walk around this age and start crawling and stuff like that. So I'm getting as much information as I possibly can. I know they're going to slow down once I get into school, but I'm also going to try to incorporate my actual life into this Rebel series because I want it to be as realistic and as fun as possible. Sophia has a birthday coming up and I cannot wait till it's her birthday. She's definitely going to have a body bag then. I'm making sure her birthday is September 9th. That's when I got her. Or when she was, not when I got her. That's when she was actually finished me. So September 9th is Sophia's birthday. And we're going to have a fun little birthday party if we are out of this house by then. If not, then we're going to have to wait a little bit. But I can always say I filmed this on September 9th. So it's it's going to be fun and I'm going to make sure it lines up progressively and all this stuff. So a lot of you guys also been asking me about adding videos. Yes, in this roleplay series there will be adding videos and I might even just not include, not even not include, but like it might be separate from the roleplay videos and I might just take her out. Um, because I feel like it's weird to roleplay Annie for the story but some people think, anyways. Also, I did a whole video on the breastfeeding in the Reborn community. A lot of people think I'm going to breastfeed since I posted that video. No, I'm not. I'm not comfortable with the whole situation. I told you guys in my video, and I made that clear. So that means you didn't watch the whole video. So go check out the video. It will be linked down below. Um, so, all this saying is, <laughs> I'm starting my video. Uh, I'm starting my role play series. A lot of you guys have been asking me about it, and yes, I am starting it. It is so fun. Um, I've been having fun filming it and coming up with the storylines. I can't wait till you guys see how creative I did with the story progression and the storyline. Um, yes, it's gonna be like a family vlog, so it's not gonna have like a whole script. Um, like none of my videos have scripts, but um, this um, how I'm telling the story. I am going to be kind of going off of a script, so I don't miss anything that will help me in the long run. But I'm not going to be like so monotone. You can tell that I'm reading or anything. Like I'm gonna just give myself key points that I want to talk about in the role play story progression thingy. So I'm going to do Nicholas, Gabriella, and Chloe the first time because they're all siblings. I'm thinking about either doing that or um, giving them each their own story because I think that's more fun and it gives you guys a lot more videos. I have I have 12 dolls, so you guys get that's 12 videos if I all do separately. So I'm thinking about separately. But not 100% sure on everything yet. It's still in the works. Like I said, I'm still filming. But I wanted to give you guys this video so you guys can know. And when I post my next video, either later this week or um, Monday, you guys, I tell you guys, watch this video first. Because so you know what's going on. So thank you guys for watching. I love you all so, so much. Peace.